So have you ever wished you could color code clips in Final Cut Pro X so you can maybe categorize your footage or find clips in your timeline much easier? Well, that's what I'm gonna show you how to do in this video. Okay, so we're in Final Cut and I'm gonna show you how you can color code your clips. I've seen a few videos of people saying this isn't possible, but it certainly is. Now, why would you wanna do this? Let's just say, for example, you're using an iPhone, you're using a Sony camera and a Panasonic camera. Maybe you want to color code your videos so you can visually see on the timeline which camera is which. It can be quite handy. But um, what we're gonna do is we're gonna right click on a clip and we're gonna to go to assign video roles. Now you can see I've already made one called Panasonic, but if you wanna make a new role, just go down to edit roles. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add a new video role and let's call that Sony camera. And we're gonna, let's leave that in the orange and let's click apply. So if we right click, you can see it hasn't changed color. But if we right click and we go to assign video roles and just make sure it is on Sony camera, it didn't apply that. You can see it's not changing the color. Let's say this one is the Panasonic. So let's assign that to Panasonic. Again, it hasn't changed color. So what's going on? Well, this only works if you, unfortunately, you need to detach the audio. So let's do that now. If we right click on here and we'll go to detach audio. Now, if we do that, you can see that we now have color coded clips. So that is the only kind of downfall with this. You do have to detach the audio. So just be careful if you are editing, because of course, if you move um, some clips and they're not connected, these are connected and you can see they'll move together. But if you disconnect them, obviously your video will move around separately from your audio. But the good thing is if you have uh, your clips connected like I do here, then as you move, your audio will move with it. So all you need to do is select all your clips, right click, hit detach, and then you can go through and then start color coding your clips. Let's make that one purple. There we go. So you can visually see in an instant what camera is what. So there we go. That's a little hack there for Final Cut Pro X. And that's how you can color code all of your footage. As I've mentioned, it's quite handy if you want to maybe color code all of uh, the footage from one camera as one color and the footage from another camera as another color. So let me know if that's helped you. If you've got any questions at all, leave them in the comment section below. And make sure to check out our full Final Cut Pro 10 playlist where we've got a ton of tutorials waiting for you there. So anyway, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.